Hi guys, welcome to the next video. It's um, interesting to say the least. Um, today I'm doing a um, photography walk for macro photography, hoping to get some insects, some nice flowers, um, anything really that takes my fancy on my walkabout and obviously I'll take you with me and you can see what's going on. I've not made a video for a month but you'll understand why when you see my next video I hope um, because it's uh, I've been on a project for about two months maybe a bit longer and it's just coming to a close now I have done a video on it so it'll all come together I guess in the next month or so but I thought I'd better get out and do one or else you'll uh, you'll be moaning where am I all my 80 followers will be wondering what's going on so sorry about the tract in the background but now to can do about that oh my mic's picking up it looks like it is um so that's the plan today photograph walk macro in fairness i have brought my 70 to 200 lens just in case um i see a little bit of wildlife that i want to take but hey we've got the macro 100 lens on we've got the um Cygnus Tech diffuser on and um, if Ron watches this just so you know I have got the name of it now and I will uh, directly message you with the name and the contact where I got the diffuser from so sorry about that um, so there we are that's where we're at so we're in Trentham Gardens you know I love it here it's a beautiful place and I'm hoping beyond hope to get some um, decent images. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll speak to you in a bit. Hey, bye for now. Hi guys, so at the moment, I'm just, um, walking around the gardens um, I'll just flick you around and then you can see what's going on it's a lovely walk you know and there's there's good paths there's, there's lots of plants and lots of flowers um, and my main aim today is to look for insects bugs flies beetles sp spiders big roofs things like that and um, try and get some decent images of them um, and I'm, I will I will give me time I will I just need to take my time and open my eyes so that's in fact what I'll do I'll go around here so um, I hope you like the shot of the small flower I'll I'll get the name of it off my wife I haven't got a clue to be honest we've got plants in our garden loads of different flowers and I don't know what they are why would I Anyway, um, uh, I'll give you a shout the next time I come up with something. Hey, speak to you in a bit. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. So what I've got now is a small fly. Um, don't tell me what type it is because I haven't got a clue. Um, but I'll try and show it you in a minute. It's just sitting on a, a, a leaf. Um, I'm all set up. Uh, I'll show you in a minute again. I'm all set up. Um, let's have a look what my settings are, eh? Just turn that round. Okay, here's my camera. Settings are 160, uh, 160, f8, ISO 400. And if I move in here, I should be able to show you the fly. Which is just disappeared <laughs> there's a lesson don't get too close don't start poking your finger at them to try and show other people what they are so that's going to happen again um, that's flown off I guess it's not going to come back so I've set all that up all ready to go and it's your fault because I was trying to show you what it was so tell you what I'll do speak to you later Bye for now. Hi guys, so just so you know, 
I've just come across the same fly sitting on a leaf here. Um, I've got it in my lens, I've got it spot on and I've taken the image. Now this is just a tiny little fly that hopefully the image will be okay. So I'll do, I'll speak to you later. Didn't make the same mistake. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. So, here I am, all set up. Let me spin you around. Um, there, over a dock leaf. Now, inside the dock leaf, if I can show you, I don't think you can see it, but up there, there is a tiny moth. Tiny. So, plan is to try and photograph it, see what it comes up with. Uh, and if it's any good, you'll be the first ones to see it, of course. Hey, speak to you soon. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. So, <clears throat> down here, if I can see it, I'm going to try and show you this insect. I think I've just got a shot of it, because you know what I did last time, I'm not going to do that again. So as I move in, you might just see him there. Yep. So, I've... Um, I've taken a shot of him, and if it's any good, you'll be the first to know, of course, because you'll be the first to see it. So, uh, hey, we're not doing too bad, actually. Um, I want to want to try and get his insects on the flowers, so you've got some more aesthetically pleasing image with um, a point of interest. Um, at the moment, it's dull and grey, and it's not very warm. <clears throat> and the insects don't seem to be uh, landing on the flowers. They seem to be a bit deeper in the undergrowth. So, anyway, secret is keep your eye in, see what happens. Hey, see you in a bit. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, we're not doing too bad. I've just got um, a lovely um, red Astrantia up the other end of there, which was really nice. Um, it was a, just a nice image. It wasn't a, so much a macro image, it's just a nice image that I quite liked. And um, at the moment, I'm just scanning um, for interesting uh, insects or, or anything really I can find. But the problem is you've got to get your eye in. Because if you don't get your eye in, you've got no chance. But um, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. If the one of the uh, red astrantias is as nice as I think it's going to be, I'll pop it up. Speak to you later. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. So I'm just on the edge of the lake here and um, as you can see, well you can't, but there you go. Uh, let's spin that around. 
I'm all set up and um, I'm just looking at, I don't know whether you'll see it or not, but there's a little beetle right on the edge here, there. Um, I'm just hoping to get a nice shot of it, but it's a bit windy, so um, I'm not sure if I will. Uh, but you know, if I do, you know what I'm going to say, don't you? You'll be first to know. I'll uh, quite enjoy myself, it's quite relaxing actually. It's a while since I've done any macro photography, and um, it is quite relaxing. So, hey, speak to you in a bit. Bye for now. <clears throat> the um, lake is looking lovely today as you can see everywhere seems really nice and actually I've just noticed and I'm going to take you take you with me <laughs> I had just noticed um, a, damsel, a lovely damselfly ah oh, it's back okay so I don't know whether you can see it it's hovering about here it's hovering about there somewhere. I don't know if you can see it, but I am, without doubt, going to try and get a shot of that. So let's see how it turns out, eh? I'll tell you what I'll do. Speak to you on a finished BFN. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. I'm down, still down by the, the lake, and I've actually found the piece of grass that the damselfly has been landing on, and I've set my tripod up <laughs> in the hope that it might come back because I believe they have like favourite perches that they go to so I'm thinking it may come back if I just spin you around like that and I can show you that there that that's cutting across the screen is where it's been landing and if I come back here you can see I'm set up on it so <sighs> You never know, do you? But the wind's blowing a bit hard. Um, so, let's see. I'm going to give you five, ten minutes here, just see what happens. If he comes back, it should be a good shot, he says. If he comes back, let's wait and see. Hey, speak to you soon. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. So what I've decided to do now is to go handheld. Um, reason is that the tripod just seems to be um, a little bit restrictive in terms of where I can get and what I can do. So um, I've decided to go handheld and I've decided to try lift my shutter speed a little bit. <coughs> and lift my ISO a little bit actually um, not too much in this camera will stand it so it's not a problem but uh, that's what I've decided to do so let's see if it becomes any clearer or if I'm able to get any better shots so tripod's gone away and we are now handheld let's see where we end up hey speak to you soon bye for now hi guys so I um, managed to find my first ladybird of the day um, actually there's two small insects on this that I'm going to try and show you in a minute um, and one's a ladybird and there's something underneath that I can't actually get a decent shot at here let's have a look see if I can show you so there's the ladybird and as you can see just under the ladybird there's something else um, but let's see what we can do, eh? If they're any good, I'll pop them up. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, it's been a bit raining and, and the, the GGI Pocket 3 doesn't deal well with rain. So I've just managed to um, capture the damselfly, the blue damselfly. And I hope 
the, the um, images are going to come okay. If they are okay, obviously, I'll, uh, I'll put them up next, at least one of them, and then maybe a few at the end. But yeah, um, first time I've got, managed to get the damselfly for a long time, so I'll uh, speak to you soon. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, just actually on the other side of the lake <clears throat> now, just having a wander. Um, I did, I don't know if I told you actually, I've just had my lunch. And my memory's great, you know, so I can't remember. I just managed to get the damselfly um, around the other side. And I think, having a quick scan over lunch, I think I've got one or two nice shots. So hopefully they should be okay. Um, but obviously, you'll, you, if, if, here goes. If they were any good, you've probably seen them by now. Because I, I, I might have said before that if they're any good, I'll show them you. Does it matter? Does it really matter? No. Anyway. I'm on the edge of the lake, on the sort of return journey, if you like, on the opposite side of the lake. And I'll just keep my eye out for one or two things and um, see what I can pull out. The problem I've got at the moment, and if anybody's listening, they can help me. They can help me with it. I'm getting a straight line and a black shadow below my image, like halfway up my image, sometimes quarter of the way up the image. I'm thinking the lens is too long for the flash. Um, but I don't know for sure. Do I need to get another lens? Do I need to get a new flash? Do you need to use flash off the camera? Will that help? Okay guys, I'll speak to you soon. Let me know if you can, one way or the other. If you have any um, any idea what what's causing it. Um, let me know and I'll see if I can put it right. Hey, obviously you won't see him because if they've got shadows across them, I wouldn't put them on, would I? You know what I'm saying? That'd be a silly thing to do. Listen, if you uh, like what I'm doing, click like and subscribe. Let's see how many we can get. Not many, I know, but do it anyway. And I'll speak to you later. Bye for now. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, oops, I not me blowing the um, microphone off. At the moment, I'm just looking at some of these ferns that are just finishing unfurling. Let me turn you around and show you this one that I'm looking at. There. I don't know if you can see that very well, but it's there. That one. And um, I want to try and get an image of that if I can. Um, I have got one or two bugs. Um, so I'm going to try and get this and just see how it turns out, eh? Speak to you soon. Hi guys, welcome back. Um, I'm just sort of heading towards the end of the <clears throat> lake now, sort of the end of the photograph, photography walk, if you like. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've you know, followed me and enjoyed some of the images that you've seen. I'm hoping to, uh, at the end, I'll put a, a few more on, obviously, that I've got. But I just hope that you've enjoyed the video. I, um, I have got the next one almost ready. But obviously it's um, the project that I've been working on at home. So you won't have that yet, probably a month's time, maybe, if I'm lucky. But um, hopefully you'll enjoy this one. Click like and subscribe if you do like it. Um, and please, if anybody can tell me, I'm nearly sure it's, it's the length of the lens that's creating the shadow at the bottom. But if anybody else knows of any other reason, um, if you could just stick a comment on let me know. If you've only just joined this channel, I am still learning. In fact, we never stop learning, do we? But, um, you know, I'm having to go with everything, as well, you know. So I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll say goodbye for now. And I'll uh, see you on the fly. BFN. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.